what's up living fam welcome back to another video as you can see from the title this is a long awaiting bathroom reveal this video has been in the making since the beginning of summer you're gonna see because my hairstyle is completely different i know my people who are here for the home decor and the home renovations and the home makeover and whatever really really gonna enjoy this video so this video is a renter friendly makeover and organization so when we moved into this bathroom so my bathroom is beautiful as it is so i don't have to do much to it for it to be pretty um so the owners the landlords they did a really good job at designing and creating the bathroom and so it's pretty as it is but the thing about it is not functional so when we moved in everything was as is we just come in put on with sit with things them and just vibes i did one and two little things but then i need i think that yo i need to start making my bathroom look better and feel better and more functional and more organized like under the cupboard was a hot mess like everywhere was just yeah chaotic and i don't i can't function when everything is chaotic so I went on a little dig and I thought that, hey, how can I make my bathroom more renter friendly? Because there are things that I really want to change in the bathroom, um, but I can't bore the walls. The whole bathroom is filled with tile. And so I can't really do anything to it at all. Not much, at least. Everything that I, I want to do to it has to be renter friendly. Everything has, I can't drill the wall. I can't do any of those things. So I went on a little dig found some really really amazing stuff on tiktok but it has become a search engine i literally go to tiktok to search for so many stuff no um if you're like me comment and let me know if you're one of those people who go to tiktok and search for things i have found so many good stuff on tiktok and so i thought i would share them with you guys some of the stuff that i found that makes my bathroom a lot more functional and so yeah so with all that said let's re we rewind to a couple months ago when i decided to start the process to um make over or bathroom <laughs> bunch of packages remember i was telling you that i ordered some stuff for the bathroom to make it more organized and you know renter friendly more comfortable and stuff so i just got a bunch of the packages that i ordered first thing i got are these storage containers for some reason i thought they were bigger but <laughs> they're not guys i'm gonna store like cotton swabs um toothpicks and so on in these like a clear plastic i got these storage bin also thought these were bigger did not know they were this small at all but they might be able to do what i really want them to do i soon show you what is this again i don't know so these are like like a tear rack and um this is what it looks like basically Oh, oh okay this is another set of shower caddy this is a tissue holder i think um these are like holders for toothpaste oh shower door hooks and then this is the final thing that i think i'm most excited about all right guys, so the first thing I'm gonna change in this bathroom is this shower head. Hopefully the replacement as I bought actually works with it. Hate this shower head and it comes with the, the rental that we have here and I've hated it since the day we moved in so I've always wanted to change it. The issue that I have with this um, shower head is that it gets clogged a lot and it also like literally went up everywhere. Like it's always wetting up this side of the, um, 
of the show I just hate it so I always have to like turn it to that side so I don't want it to project and wet up the place Are we gonna get our rain fall show? Let's see. Oh. Oh. Ah. Look at this! And guess what? The good thing about it is that I can turn it all the way. Like I can literally turn it in different directions. You see that power, that flow that is coming out of it? So the shower caddy came with uh, four of these uh, um, sticky stuff that you're going to use to stick on the tile. And it came with uh, two soap holder and three of these. Two, three, a bigger one, a smaller one, and then a smaller one. I guess I'm trying to decide if I'm gonna put it here, if I'm gonna put the shower caddies here, or am I gonna put them here? Considering that the shower, the shower head, I don't, it can go in whatever direction I want to go in. It's not like it was the other one that was there before, where I had to push it to the side and then it would wet up this side. So I'm kind of trying to decide if I should actually use this side for the shower caddy, like here. Let me show you guys here here and here or should i just put it on this wall for some reason i'm feeling that wall if we're gonna show it here all right tell you what i'm gonna put it on this wall this one so when i walk into the bathroom i'm gonna see it and it's gonna force me to organize it all the time so i think i'm gonna put it here so i'm gonna dry it comes with four of them so the good thing about this is that you can actually hang like your rags and stuff on these and like your um what do you call me like your scrubs and stuff you can actually hang on these i'm actually putting so, so it won't be front and center when i'm hanging up my like my loofahs and stuff on there it won't be front and center if that makes sense so yeah So for so long we've moved into this place and this came with the apartment. This is a built-in tissue holder that really really sucks. I hate it. So for all the times what I've been doing is leaving the tissue right there on the side of the bath tub. Saw this tissue box on TikTok and it was just perfection. The fact that it comes with the adhesive to actually stick on the tile perfect 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 and these are the adhesive that goes on the tile to hang this tissue holder on and the, the cute thing about this tissue holder is that you can actually stack anything you want in there when you want to put wipes in there you want to put like sanitary stuff like your um we call it panty liners, tampon, or whatever can go in here. But most likely I'm going to utilize it for wipes, I think, for now. And so it comes with the little stuff down here that the TC actually goes on. Which is I actually have to connect this part here and screw it in. Um, but I don't know, I think I'm going to do that last. 
other side, I don't know if you guys can see. Then you screw, hopefully, there's some, yeah. So these are the shower hooks, basically, I'm going to hang them inside the shower and hang our towels on them. You can also use them for if you have your robe and stuff in the shower, you can definitely do that as well. actually very 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 chaotic and so I am going to organize all of this using the containers that I got from Amazon bought two of these and these are they go underneath the counter I need to check I need to check my um my Amazon to see because I put So the under counter tear thing, I ordered two of them but only one reach. I don't know what happened, um, why only one of them came. So the other one says it's on its way, which is kind of a bummer, so I have to wait on that um, in order to fully like organize under here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to do as much as I can now until that other one gets here. Um, but so far, I actually think I like it. I don't know if I have enough space. Um, that's like my concern right now and I feel like one more like one more could actually go on top here based on how tall underneath the counter is so I'm just gonna stop what I have on here and then um, I guess I'll figure out the rest of it as I go along like I was saying um, these are a lot smaller than I thought they would have been so I think I'm gonna have to probably buy another set, but a bigger size, uh, as opposed to the size that I have now. So, yeah. 
But I think these can hold like my panty liners and stuff. So that's what I really bought it for, like my panty liners and stuff. I think I might need another one of the tears. Apart from the two that I want, I feel like I probably want another one tear on this side and then another tear on this side and then this would have sat in the middle. So I feel like another set of this can hold right here and the other tear under there. Or I get two more tears on that side and possibly get another one. So I'd have maybe four under there, but I don't know yet. Um, I have to wait until I get the rest of them to this side. So let me just stack these in the meantime. This is probably a pre preliminary stack. Because I think I might have to make some changes when I get the other stuff. for this bathroom now when we moved here the bathroom had this shower head that I really really hated um I hated it but I didn't do anything about it at the time and so I decided to go hunting on Amazon to see if I could find a replacement for the shower head so that we can have like a waterfall feel in the shower you guys, when I tell you this is the best purchase I've made for the bathroom um, ever. We've been having the best showers ever. I've never felt so clean in all my life since we've moved into this apartment. Since we literally, since I decided to change the shower head. The power that comes out, the water that comes out of the shower head is just so luscious. It makes me feel like I'm at a spa. spa. It's so luxurious. So I really, really love that. I really, really love also the tissue holder, which is so, so awesome because the tissue holder, all it needs is adhesive to put onto the, stick onto the tile. And so the one that was there before it was broken. We can, it's in a very awkward place in the corner where it's so awkward to reach over there and add a tissue to it. It fall off sometimes. So that was a horrible, decision for the bathroom in the first place um whoever built this place and thought that was a good idea was a bad idea and we have them right throughout the house in the other bathrooms and they're absolutely trash so i hate them and do not recommend do not recommend the good thing about this tissue holder that we have is that if we build our bathroom you can actually mount it on the wall because it comes with screws so it has a section that it can be tile where um it can go can go on the tile and it can also go on like wall you can actually screw it in so it's not necessarily just one you know one section it can use for both um yeah the shower caddies were actually very good idea to hold all my products before all my products were on the side ledge there um inside of the shower where you should actually sit and so um, I hated that. And so putting them on the wall makes the bathroom look more aesthetically pleasing. And also I can easily just stand at my height and just grab the things that I need for my shower, which is awesome. I had already had uh, a shower caddy in here already where I keep all my skincare stuff on the side of the where the sink is. So those hold my skincare, those hold like my deodorant, all of those things. All things skincare related is on that little shelf. All the lotion, the hair products and stuff is underneath the um in the underneath the cupboard. And uh, the trays that I bought, those level, I guess I don't remember what you call them, for storage underneath the counter. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I could actually fit two more under there if I if I wanted to. If I had more stuff to actually put on there. I'm glad I bought them. They were very reasonable in price. I'm going to link everything in the description box. 
um for you guys so it works out very well to keep my products under there and to keep it organized because before i literally could not see all the things i have now i can actually see the things i have and then now i don't have to have a lot of junk under there because i throw them out because i don't have the space for the junk so yeah perfect 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 so all of those things were a very good idea for this bathroom i added some plants some greenery i added a little greenery where the shower um head is um just give it a little bit of uh, yeah i have another plant that i want to put in here but i need to get a nice decent pot for it so it's a snake plant um that i have for it and i also decided to move my piece lily from downstairs and put it in the bathroom here where i think it's thriving I'm yet to see it bloom. It hasn't bloomed in so many years. So I'm yet to see, see it bloom. I feel like it's thriving in the bathroom better than it is than it was thriving downstairs. And also decided to add, um, I had these, these picture frames where I had the, if you had watched my, one of my, I think entryway, entryway tour, in the last apartment that we were in i had shown these i had put change out the pictures and all of that and put them in these nice beautiful frames and so i think the tub needed something around it and i think that was the perfect um the perfect thing to put there in that little corner so you can see from so you have the love job peace patient kindness you know fruits of the spirit and then uh, over the toilet the idea for over the toilet i really wanted to get an adhesive towel rack and they are very expensive on amazon so i just opt for that and say yo we we'll just keep the, the towels in there so for a moment but i think eventually i'm gonna get one like an adhesive towel rack to put over where the toilet is but for now on top of the toilet i'm gonna have I'm going to keep this there, the, the candle, another one of the picture frames and some, actually my bouquet, my bouquet from when we got married, yes, so yeah, and all the little other things like the cotton pads, the holder, the um, toothpicks, with the toothpicks being there, um you know it's easy grab and go and so perfect 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 you guys so i really hope you guys enjoyed this video give me a thumbs up let me know if you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you want to see more of these videos yeah they're expensive to make but we can make it happen thank you guys for watching until next time i'll catch you in the next one